What up, guys? This is a new episode of unboxings and recent pickups. This is going to be a recent pickups, a movie special pickups. Um, I went back the last couple of weeks and I picked up a whole mess of Blu-ray movies that I've been collecting, that I've been gathering up, and uh, I want to make this video to pretty much cover all of them. I'm going to be getting a lot more the next actually few weeks. There's a couple, um, quite a few that I have ordered. There's a few that I'm waiting for it to come out. But this is my recent pickups um, over the course of, like I said, probably, well, probably the middle of the summer or so. But these are my Blu-rays, so we're going to get right into them. And there's a lot of 3D Blu-rays in here because I do have a, um, I, I, we have a giant theater in here with the Samsung curved 4K, a 3D TV with the 3D Blu-ray, and the 4K Blu-ray player. So, with the glasses and all that. Well, this is regular Blu-ray here. This is The Revenant with Leonardo DiCaprio. Um, I'll just talk about each movie very shortly here. Uh, it's not to take up too much time in the pickups video, but um, I absolutely loved this movie. I thought this movie was really good. Um, I could see this movie not being for everybody if it's not your type of thing, but I'll tell you what, I absolutely liked it a lot. Um, I was a big fan of, like, you know, Jeremiah Johnson, you know, The Edge, um, you know, The Outlaw Josie Wales. This movie has so many influences from all those movies and so many more that it's, it's really hard to explain. You really got to see it. Um, edge of Your sh Seat Excitement stunning stunning visual stunning quality and, and this is a well made movie and I absolutely love this movie and I tell you what they they did a really good job and uh, they actually surprised me quite a bit The Revenant uh, just picked this up not too long ago on Blu-ray so you could tell when you watch this movie it was also shot with an IMAX camera you could just tell the way the camera pans it's a very unique style I think it really fits in this Blu-ray copy here We got Batman the Killing Joke. I actually got this the same day I picked up the hardcover copy of the book, the graphic novel of the same name. Uh, this is pretty cool. This is a nice slip sleeve cover here uh, with an embossed graphic of the Joker here. Very cool. Uh, very classic artwork there. Uh, this one comes with the Blu-ray, it comes with the DVD, and it comes with the Digital HD, the Ultraviolet, they call it which is pretty cool. As you can see here, here's the back. Um, a very famous comic book that, you know, that I, I loved reading when I was young. And it's, it's one of the classics, one of the all-time greatest graphic novels ever. Um, and the anime film is just the same. I really enjoyed it. I, I really love the quality of the movie. Um, I'm actually, I want to watch it actually again, see what I missed the first time around. Take the slip sleeve slip cover off. You have the regular standard there, like so. Be sure there's no codes or nothing. Yeah. Sometimes they slip those digital ultraviolet codes in there. Um, I like to throw them on my iPad, on my phone, and watch them digitally too. But pretty neat, pretty cool. Got the nice black and white there. One's actually a little darker than the other one. So the DVD one is a little bit lighter. And the Blu-ray one is a little bit darker. Pretty neat. So, yeah, The Killing Joke. Batman The Killing Joke, really good. I know there was quite a few people upset about it, upset with the whole Batgirl thing and hashtag bat sex. Come on. Get with it, you know what I mean? I'll save these two guys for last. Uh, one of my older pickups. I just never owned it. If you go back on the channel here, um, I recently unboxed, along with a video game, I forget what it was, but um, I think it was ReCore. I'm not sure. I don't remember. But anyway, um, oh, I think it was Bioshock Collection. I picked up The Conjuring 2. It showed it off in that same video. And I've seen The Conjuring 1 over and over again, dozens of times on demand, on Amazon Prime, this, that, the other thing. But I never owned the Blu-ray copy. I've owned older versions on DVD and whatnot, so I finally picked up the Blu-ray copy. It was on sale on Amazon Prime, 
and I ordered that, and uh, I'm glad to own this now. A really great, great horror film. Um, what a perfect time of year to watch it. I'm going to be, during the month of October, I like to uh, watch all my scary movies, uh, including The Exorcist, Salem's Lot, Cujo, Pet Cemetery, uh, The Shining, Carrie, Christine, The Ring, Blair Witch, all that. So, definitely uh, watch this copy of The Conjuring. I have not seen the Blu-ray version yet. I'm sure it looks fine. Uh, and then I saved these two for last because these two are pretty cool. Um, these are 3D Blu-ray. This one here has been out a while. I finally picked up the Ultimate Edition as opposed to the Standard Version. Um, and I wanted the 3D version of the movie. Um, this is the Blu-ray 3D plus Blu-ray plus Digital HD. It has the holographic cover. Very sick. Very cool. Um, it comes with the extended cut of over 30 of 30 minutes, extended cut with 30 minutes, um, adding a lot of story, backstory to the movie, stuff that was left out, uh, you know, for the convenience of, you know, the theater, um, and, uh, you know, really sick stuff, it's got the ultraviolet digital, um, I absolutely loved this movie, I thought this movie was really good, I know people had a mixed bag on it, some really loved it, some didn't like it, I loved it, I thought it was really good. I'm a huge Batman and Spider Spider-Man, Batman and Superman fan and Wonder Woman, and I thought this movie was really well done. Could it have been better? Of course it could have. Everything could have been better. But you get what you get, and that's how it came out, and I'm happy with it. Uh, this movie looks stunning. Uh, I actually used this. Well, actually, this and uh, Civil War uh, to show off our 3D TV and our 3D Blu-ray player. Where people come over, we put the glasses on them. They get the biggest kick out of it. Um, I absolutely love watching their faces. It's priceless. Uh, I'm going to be doing the same with company when they come over with the PlayStation VR. I pre-ordered the, uh, the special edition bundle. But there we go. Pretty cool. Put that back in the sleeve. And again, you know, I, I always download the digital versions. I know um, I always put up these pictures on Instagram of my collections, and everybody always says, oh, hey, send me the ultraviolet violet copy uh, code. I want to use it, but I use them. If I didn't, believe me, I would give them away or do like a contest or something, but I do like to watch them on the go on my handheld devices. Civil War, Captain America, this is a fantastic movie, and this is a movie that everybody loved. Um... And very well deserved. It's an excellent movie, and it's absolutely stunning on 3D. Another movie to show off um, if you own a 3D player. Uh, this is the collector's edition. This features the Blu-ray 3D, the regular Blu-ray, and the digital HD ultraviolet. There's the back. Take the cover off. There's the standard case. With the cover off. Oh, and there's something to show you, too. Something to note. Um, pretty cool. It's got the Blu-ray and the standard Blu-ray. But what's cool is, I think it's cool, one's masked, one's unmasked. Pretty cool. A little nice little touch to the packaging. Some of these 3D Blu-rays and whatnot, they, they have really nice, stunning packaging. I mean, you have to admit, look at the, this, this packaging is... Beyond amazing. So there you go. That is my recent pickups um, as far as movie Blu-rays and 3D Blu-rays. I will see you again soon on a new episode. Until then, thanks for joining, stopping by, and take care. I will see you guys again soon. Bye-bye.